Hello again, it's Lock Noob, and we have here the double F logo of a Fascinetti or Faccinetti or Facanetti. I don't know how to pronounce it. If you are Italian, please let me know. Um, and this is a, a Fascinetti armored shutter lock um, with a hardened steel shackle, full brass body, and um, these. Are actually relatively rare to come by in the UK. You can get them, but they tend to only sell these Fashionetti padlocks to um, uh, property services and things like that for locking up um, construction sites and shop fronts and that kind of thing. Um, so I'm, I'm actually very lucky to have this one, and um, I, for the life of me, I can't remember who gave it to me, which is very, very bad form, isn't it? Um, but let's just have a go at picking. Let's go in with uh, the pick, and this is a five pin lock, so um, no, don't like that tensioner. Try him. Let's actually just open it over with a key first, shall we? Hey, there we go. Got to watch out for this because it's got very strong spring, um, and the whole thing pops out because I think. I think this little ball bearing down here has got stuck somehow. Probably needs a bit of grease to free up. Okay, anyway, back to picking, eh? Good stuff. All right. Okay, uh, five, four, three. Nice positive clicks, two. One, that's the back, five, four, three, two, into a false set. Uh, oh, and we're open actually, it's not a false set, that's an open. Wow, and we're open. Um, so interesting, I didn't feel a single spool in that at all. I thought I hit a false set, but I didn't, it was just open. And look how little movement that core takes. That's probably, what, 25 degrees maybe from turning, uh, maybe 30, uh, and that that's an open. Uh, disappointing, really disappointing this lock, but I really love it. This is a, a good one for my collection. I, I really like getting uh, things like these Fashionettis because they're genuinely quite hard to get hold of. Um, but despite, uh, well, it's actually despite, I was going to say a good bitting and a perfectly average bitting, it's opened um, very briskly. Oh, what a shame. All right, well, shame about the lock, but I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you next time. And we're back because I just thought to myself, ooh, I wonder if it rakes, so I grabbed my trusty Sparrow's Worm, which um, I think is a, a brilliant little rake, and uh, I just had a, a little go at, um, at raking the lock. Let's see if I can uh, replicate what I did last time. And we're open, there we go. So yeah, it's rakeable too, so I can't imagine there's a single security pin in this lock at all. All right, I'll see you next time.